Hello, Pestilence here with a registered U.S. mail lock. Uh, you've probably seen these. Uh, if you're on eBay, you've seen them. Uh, Bosnian Bill did a video on it, and um, the lock picking lawyer, he also did a video before that where he actually disassembled them. And I'm going to uh, pick it on camera if things go well. Uh, this one is on 208. Yeah, let's see if we can see that. Not wearing my glasses, not wearing my glasses. And yeah, close enough. Okay. <clears throat> so, I picked it once before, and so we will see if I can do it again. Because the uh, the pins are in the very back. There's only three pins. I've got quite a bit of tension on that. And loosen it up a little and felt one pin go down, felt another pin go down. Now we're at the very back. Now, from my brief understanding, or I should say limited limited understanding, um, it is not legal to own a key for these because it's master keyed. And while they do not, uh, I guess they still use some of these. I'm not sure if they make any more of them. As I said, my limited understanding. So, people have gotten into trouble for trying to make keys. People have gotten into trouble for trying to buy keys. Uh, I've seen one on sale on eBay with a key. I don't know. Might even get in trouble just for talking about keys. Who knows? Oddly enough, the first time that I picked this, the only time I've picked this, uh, I barely just I pushed down on the pins and boom, 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 and it was open. Uh, isn't that the way it usually goes, though?
trying to protect. There we go. Okay. And boom, 209. Let's see which way was I turning this. And, okay, 209. Success. I guess that's the advantage. If I can't pick it right-handed, I can pick it left-handed. Usually I can pick it both-handed, not at the same time. Okay. I do uh, want to do a, a video on what locks are worth or not what they're worth. Let me back that up. I'm going to cut that out. I don't know what I'm saying. Thanks for watching. Take care. Stay legal. Bye.